Local agencies are in overdrive, planning ahead for a snowstorm that could hit green country with blizzard conditions. Of course, uh, we're real concerned about not only the amount of snow being predicted, but the, the cold and the wind that's been projected also. As an emergency plan develops between local agencies and first responders, Tulsa County street crews are on standby. With more than 750 miles of roads across Tulsa County, crews will clear the main roads first. They coordinate with the smaller communities um, outside of Tulsa to make sure that they don't double up and they aren't both assigned the same road and so that we make the best use of the equipment and the materials. EMSA is stocking up ambulances with food, water, shovels, and other supplies. Emergencies don't stop. Uh, emergencies don't care if it's raining or snowing or if it's light or dark outside. They have extra staff on duty and tows ready for ambulances in case they get stuck. So they are big. They are, you know, well equipped to drive on, on roads that are even snow packed they can get around. But as far as when there's a lot of snow or ice accumulations, they'll slide like any other vehicle. With possible snow drifts forecasted, EMSA crews have blue tape ready to mark abandoned cars. This shows other crews that they've checked on the vehicle and the people inside. EMSA recommends you stock your car with supplies and only leave the house if you really need to. We will get through this. This is not a, a national disaster. We're going to have some, some problems that will overcome and then it will all go away. It's, it's snow after all. Volunteers with the Red Cross stocked up to open shelters across Northeast Oklahoma for stranded motorists. So today we are again um, supplying food and really snacks at this, at, at this point for our shelters so that our guests who are there um, will always have something to eat.